All right, guys, I'm going to do this video on the uh, Porsche 911 Coupe uh, headliner rods. If you bought the ones from our host and they don't fit, and they're actually a, a Porsche item. So I also went to the local Porsche dealership and bought a brand new set of headliner rods through them directly and they are completely identical as the ones from our host. You see they, mine, these are the yellow. That's the yellow ones. See right there, yellow and yellow. These are ones from our host. They're identical. The green ones, you see down, I took it out of the package so you can see it better. The green, the white, see the actual Porsche numbers on them. They all line up. And then I didn't even take these green ones out of the uh, bag because why? There's no point. It's the part numbers. So then a friend of mine had a wrecked car and I took his headliners out. Gave me a good deal on them so I couldn't refuse. And you can see how they line up, nice and perfect. And let me grab a white one. Here's a white one here. You can see the difference. It's got the white mark. They just don't line up whatsoever. Completely, no matter what you do, it's hanging off the edge. If you want to line it up like this, like theirs is, hard to do this with one hand. Anyway, this is how off it is on a radius. Look at that. That's how off the bend is. You see, put them right next to each other. And these are the white ones. You see? white and the white. I haven't put a white tape on it. You follow it across. This is the white. And look, look at that bend. These are why they won't flip up and lock into their seat. Now here's a green one. Okay. Got the green. I'm going to put this right over top of that one. You can see again now these are brand new from the dealership these are Porsche parts that the guy or I don't know what you want to call it what they did wrong but it's completely wrong let me take one back so you can see better now these are the two greens try you try to uh, line them up and they just don't line up. If you want to put the arch, sorry for the video, it's I'm doing this with one hand and you know, I'm having the same problem trying to put these damn things in your car. Look at that. And this is what people bought brand new ones from the dealership and this is the problem that they're having and this is what the problem is. Look, it doesn't matter. There are the greens, and now we'll go to the yellow. Find the yellow one. Yep, there's a yellow one. This is a brand new one also. It's been sitting in my garage for the last couple years because that one there doesn't have the headliner. And I like to put the headliner in this one. So I'm gonna have to fabricate these and bend them. Now the yellow is actually the closest one if you line it up this way, the yellow is the closest. See, the radius ain't that far off, but it still won't fit. So you're gonna have to like cut it, bend it, and re-weld it in order to get these to fit. But in order to do it, you're gonna have to have original sets. So if you don't mind the rust or whatever, or want to do some sanding, I would source some used ones if you can. If you want to spend time, I mean, I already wasted the money on these. So I'm going to go ahead and 
straighten them out and put them back into shape. And I got headliners waiting to go in that one and headliner waiting to go in that one. So, but, all right, well, just want to show you guys what's the problem and people banging their heads and people are saying you're not doing it right. No, the dealership didn't uh, make the headline and rods right. So let me know what you think.